What's up, everybody? Chuck the Biz back with you today. And uh, today I'm going to do this little review, you know, because I like to get, I review, I like to review the stuff that most people don't get, you know. Um, and today I have a product that I've been eating for some time that's, uh, you can't get it just anywhere. And uh, what we have here is it's um, called Stumps is the name, and it's Hot Olives. So this, the longer I sit, the hotter I get. Um, it's got the little smartphone feature. There you go. Hit that with your smartphone scanner. Take you right to the website, and it'll show you what they're all about. Now, this company makes hot pickles, Jardinet, uh, a hot Bloody Mary mix. You know, and I've had all of them, and I figured I had these sitting around, and then because I got a buddy that brings these back from Wisconsin. Okay, I work with him, and he brings them back. I can't buy them here where I'm at. Um, fairly on the expensive side, but they're worth every penny you spend on them um, because they're that good. Um, it's got the history. Um, 1996 Jim Stumps Hackison was hungry for something with a little kick. Stump always had loved hot foods. On a trip to Belize, Stump was introduced to a rare variety of habanero pepper. Stump used this knowledge to make the perfect blend for his green olives. With the support of family and friends, Jim started the Stumps brand in his Afton, Wisconsin kitchen. As the popularity of the hot olives skyrocketed, the operation moved to a licensed manufacturing facility that could accommodate the demand of his hot little treats. With the added manufacturing capability, Stump has, was able to focus his attention on the development of more products to satisfy all tastes. Stumps now have a Mediterranean olive for those who like garlic and basil. We have expanded our line to include a rich Bloody Mary mix. The Bloody Mary mix serves as a wonderful chili starter and is available in hot and a mild variety. Um, it says here, ingredients, queen olives, water, minced pimentos, salt, lactic, lactic acid, sodium alginate, guar gum and calcium chloride seasonings spices and natural flavoring which it doesn't go into detail what the exact spices are but it does consist of a habanero pepper from belize which i don't even know what it is um so yeah here we go bam in your face with the scissors Bam, Edward Scissor Hands. As you can see, they're nice. They're huge olives. They're huge. I've actually taken these olives and I took the pimentos out and I've stuffed them with blue cheese. Phenomenal. So, yeah, what you have here. I'm the only one to eat these, so I'm using my fingers. So, what you have here is a nice, big, huge olive. Now, when you first bite these, they take you by they take you by surprise because you get the saltiness of the olive. You're like, oh yeah, nice olive, and boom! It's like a little heat packet went off in your mouth because it gets hot. Mind you, now it's not real hot. I share these with people because everybody at work is afraid of everything that I bring in that says hot on it. So, but that being said, your average Joe consumer. Can enjoy these and obviously the more you eat the hotter they get the flavor profile on these are just it's so intense and up front which I'm not a big olive fan but I love these things you get the nice saltiness of the green olive the it has a medium texture it's got just a little bit of crunch to it you know and, and then it's got that little kicker and kicker in, of the heat. Nice and juicy, nice texture, crunchy. Great flavor profile. The added kick of the heat. 
which is in the spices, whatever he uses. Um, as far as I know, I, you can only get these in Wisconsin. Because I'm I'm here in Indiana and I haven't found and I haven't found anything and I I got like I said I have to have them brought back to me from my buddy that goes uh back and forth. So um you can order these online. They'll ship them to your house. If you like olives and you like hot stuff, these things are just off the chart. Like seriously. Got the little sweetness of the pimento in there. You got the saltiness of the olive. You got the heat from the spices. I mean, it's an all-around, all-in-your-face package right here in this little jar. Stumps hot olives. Like I said, everything they make, he has the, the heat dialed in perfectly to balance with the other flavors, the saltiness, the sweetness. It, I can't say enough about these. I, I I always have a jar of these, always. I don't know if you can hear the crunch, but like I said, the flavor profile is dynamite. So, I just wanted to share these with you. Yeah, and they come in a mason jar. I gotta love that. So... I would highly recommend suggesting uh, uh, checking these out, man, because I love them. I, I absolutely love them. Like I say, you take them out, I stuff them with blue cheese. You can do whatever you want. Cut them up, put them on your pizzas, put them in a salad. All kinds of uses for this little product right here. So, I'm going to end this for now. This, uh, this is Chuck the Biz. Thanks for tuning in.